I'm here with Mark Plachis, world-renowned runner and one of the owners of the Boulder Running Company. Mark, what is a video gate analysis and who would benefit from this service? Um, a, a video gate analysis is really um, an active mechanical test for us to determine if a shoe uh, a particular shoe is going to work for a particular individual. So we'll bring somebody um, that wants to get a pair of shoes, put them in a pair of shoes, have them um, run on the treadmill, we tape it and then we play it back frame by frame because most of the time if you try and pick up something with your naked eye, the, the mechanic, the motion is too quick. So we play it black, back slowly, frame by frame, and then we determine if the shoe is going to work mechanically or not. And everybody can benefit from it, whether they're a walker or a runner, or even somebody that just wants to see if a basketball shoe or a hiking shoe is going to be supportive enough for them. Just looking at your foot before you even do anything, you have a very particular foot type in that you have your second metatarsal is longer than your first metatarsal. That particular foot type is called a Morton's. Um, it's, it's a Morton's toe, the second metatarsal is longer. 90% of people ha don't have that. They have this, their big toe being longer than the second toe. This particular uh, foot type lends itself to a very particular um, motion problem when you run. Um, most people will pronate in their rear foot. People with Morton's pronate in their forefoot. Uh, you'd be a classic example of somebody who doesn't function the way their feet determine. Oh, okay. So if I had to take a, a wild guess what you would look like on the video based on what your feet look like, I wouldn't say you'd look this good in, a, in this particular shoe because this shoe is a neutral cushion shoe. So that's the reason why we do both things. We look at, we do an a, a active test and we do a passive test. So typically what happens with people with your foot type is that when they come into toe off, they roll the whole foot medially. They really push off on the inside of their foot, okay? So the, the insert we mentioned earlier would be one way of, of controlling that. Um, another way of controlling that obviously is getting a custom orthotic. Now, I'm a, I'm a big proponent of orthotics, not, because, uh, not only because I make it, but most people who run 30 miles or more a week consistently, an orthotic customizes the shoe, but it also stops people from getting injuries. And the biggest mistake that, not mistake, the biggest fallacy that's out there about orthotics is that orthotics stops your foot from, from, from uh, moving normally. The whole goal of an orthotic is to stop excessive motion. It still allows the normal motion of your foot, but it stops excessive motion. So, you know, that's the alternative. You can do a custom um, orthotic that you have to, you know, take a cast, or you can do an over-the-counter orthotic. And in your case, you, you know, either one could work just as well. I now know that a video gate analysis is a great way, in addition to actually looking at, you know, having somebody look at my feet to determine, you know, what type of a shoe I will need um, to help prevent injuries and to help set me up for success with my exercise. Absolutely. So thank you.